everybody, I'm Chris Provost and you're watching Provost Park Pass. And today's video, I'm gonna show you some hotels that are not on, they're not they're off property. They're a little more affordable, they're value, they're very close to Universal and uh, uh, Magic Kingdom, Walt Disney World. Plus, by staying at these hotels, you still get the perks of being able to get into the uh, Magic Kingdom parks early, early entry. What? Yeah, that's right. So let's go check them out. The first one we're looking at is the B Hotel. Be good. All right. So I'm going to be showing you a few different hotels in this particular video. When you see a hotel that you would like to stay at, I want, I'm turning each time I get to the hotel, I'm going to give you a little keyword. Type it down below. If you want to stay at this hotel, type in B, B E E, B E E, if you want to stay at this particular hotel. All right, let me show it to you. Let's go. I've stayed here at this hotel. It's a very nice hotel. It's very plush. It is very close. You're about 10, 10 15 minutes or so from uh, Walt Disney World. Very nice area. And it's really, it's cool. It's like, kind of kind of like, almost like a Miami vibe. Boom! B! We are in the B lobby. I love it. It's very plush. I like one of my favorite colors. Everything here, it feels literally like you are in Miami. Now, if you want to book one of these hotels, it's super simple. You just click the link down below and you're going to get the very best prices. Again, staying here, you're going to save a little bit of money. It's off property, but you still get the benefits. You'll still be able to get early entry into uh, the Walt Disney World of theme parks. Yeah, and they also give you a complimentary shuttle. What? Yeah, shuttle. So you don't have to worry about like Uber or whatever. A shuttle comes here, it'll pick you up and take you to the Disney resorts. Boom, pow. Now this resort, I mean, it is really tall. The building, is, if you can see it, it's like way, way up there. You're gonna, it's like a high rise. Woo, woo, woo. You can make a giant little B on the side up there because we're at the B Hotel. But they also have a swimming pool. They got lots of little games right here. They have a pool bar. I mean, it's a fun place to come and relax. I mean, like if you want the Miami feel, this is it, this is it. This is the Be Indulged Avita Spa, and then right over here is the pool, nice little pool area. You see a pool here? They have like this little splash area. And then in the afternoons, this is the outdoor pool bar for you to just kind of hang out in. Now, Amanda wants me to tell you this. She says this is very important, and it never even crossed my mind to mention this. When you first come into this, the lobby, this area, you are just, you can just, it smells so good. This hotel smells amazing. It smells really good. And Amanda, and she loves it. She, she wanted me to tell you that, how good it smells here. Because it smells so good. And this is the lobby area you check in. It's just cool. Look at the fireworks. Looks amazing. All right. All right. We're going fast here. I am going down to the very next hotel. Boom. Let's go. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. We're going. We're on our Okay, so the next hotel I'm going to be showing you is the Sonesta S Suites. Here we go. Let's check it out. Now, the Sonesta S Suites is a very, very good value. It is off property. It's about five miles away from Magic Kingdom. About maybe, and the farthest one away is maybe six miles away from uh, Animal Kingdom. But you can just Uber there really fast and get there in about 10 minutes. This one, if, if you stay here, you are going to get, a, I mean, a, a suite for your family to stay at. But be aware, you don't get the, this is off property. You don't get the perk of early entry. Uh, like we talked about the B Resort, that one does. This one here, you don't get the early entry uh, perk, but the rooms more than make up for that. So let's go check it out. The Sonesta S Suites. This place is sweet. See what I did there? Okay, so here I am in the lobby of the Sonesta S Suites. This place is absolutely awesome. It is stunning. Now, this is the type of place you want to come to if you like this. The, it has like a it's a suite. When I say suite, I mean you got a kitchen, you got like a uh, suite with multiple people, and there's like places to get food and you can cook and all this. It really is awesome. You're about ten minutes away from Universal Studios, five minutes away from Sea World, five minutes away from Disney. I mean, this place is just centrally located, which is really nice. Now, I'm going to show you the room so you can see that. And the room has a kitchen so you can cook, but they also have a comp they have a, a breakfast here. Uh, you, uh, that's an additional thing you want to get breakfast. They also serve Starbucks here, which is really sweet, which is really cool. And the pool, by the way, the pool is heated year round. They keep the temperature of the pool 89 to 90 degrees. Wham. So even though it's super cold, they said the steam's coming up, which is a big crowd pleaser. So the pool is heated. Another amenity they have out here, they have like this nice little area where you can kind of lounge, they have like these chairs, and they also have like uh, grills. So if you go to the grocery store, you buy some meat, and come over here, you grill up some meat, and have your own barbecue. I mean, this is a great place for families. There's lots of things to do. See, you can spread out, have your room, or you can all be together, whatever you want to do. Well, what if you're staying here for a long time and you need to do laundry because you're worried that you're like, my clothes, I need to wash my clothes. Not a problem, guess laundry right here. 
All right, this pool place is amazing. It's a little splash. This is a one foot pool. That means you can only put one foot in at a time. <laughs> it is a little tight pool. Look at these little tiny uh, Adirondack chairs for children. Now the pool, like I said, is heated to 89 to 90 degrees. It is a crowd pleaser. It's awesome. It's open year round. You come out here, relax at the pool. They got towels for you. They got places and benches, Adirondack chairs. They've got showers. I mean, like if you need to take a shower. Is that how everybody showers? And also like our son Miles loves this. They have a game room, check it out. Everything, you come in here, play with some games, just come relax. Nice little game room in here for kids. When I wanted to, you know, they're like, dad, dad, dad. And you're like, what, what, what? Like, can I play a game? I'm like, sure, let's go to the game room. All right, so here we go. We're gonna go in this room and check out this amazing room. This is, look at this. This is why they call it a suite. You see this? You have this nice little suite area. This folds out into a bed if you need that too. You got a kitchen area here. Uh -huh. And then it's like a full size kitchen. When I say this, look, you've got your oven, you got a microwave, you have your uh, refrigerator, this even a dishwasher. So this is like everything that you need. So you guys go shopping, go go shopping, come over here and bring your food. Not a problem. Also, they have all the plates that you need here. Now, me keep in mind, it says sweet. So this is the first bedroom that we're gonna be talking, going into, check this out. Ah, you've got two, like, these queen beds are beautiful. And by the way, I gotta do, remember how Amanda talks to me, told you, tell you about this? It smells clean, very clean, I love it. This here is the, is the one bathroom, hey! And then you go in here, you'll notice it's a bended bar, which I love, and then you've got the shower. Nice, nice, nice. Now there's also more, you got a little writing desk over there. I'm gonna walk right over here. And then right across the way you got this, it's like the master bedroom, it's a giant, it's a bigger bed right here. This is like where the grandparents stay, right? The grandparents get this room. You got the sink over here, a little bathroom over here with the shower with a bended bar. We love the bended bars, we love that over here. And then look over here, look at this giant closet with a full length mirror so you can check yourself out before you go to the theme parks for the day. Ah. This is a type of place you want to come with like a, maybe like your whole family. It's a real good place. It's a very good value, right? This is good value. Now keep in mind, uh, you don't get the, uh, the early entry like you do at the other hotel, but this has an amazing value. And also, I'm just gonna say, they do have a shuttle that'll take you to where you need to go. So, if, and you can, the shuttle is $10 per person. So this is what I would recommend. I would probably just recommend Ubering. It's probably cheaper to Uber and you get there faster. That's just me. Hey, if you want to take a shuttle, that's perfectly fine. But this is a perfect home base for when you're on vacation. Come here, relax. You've got the nice pool, got a nice little area to cook and barbecue. And then your room is amazing. It's going to fit pretty much everywhere in your whole family. Stay here. Uh -huh. All right, let's move on to the next hotel. Whoa, now I'm at a hotel campus. What's a hotel campus? Well, if you look right over here, you got the Springville, Springville Suites. Right over there, you got the Fairfield Inn and Suites. And right here, you got the Courtyard Marriott. All three of them. And these are some of the best sellers for getaway today. They got, these are very affordable. This is a value area. They're awesome. You're about 5.6 miles away from Magic Kingdom and about six miles away from Animal Kingdom and about maybe 15 minutes away from Universal Studios. Very, very conveniently located. Let's check them out. I have something to say. <laughs> stay away, go, go stay away. It always has to do with food, right? But we were told that there's restaurants right here. So if you stay at any of these three properties, you get to experience the restaurants and two of these I think have complimentary breakfast. So let's find out which ones because I'm all about the food guys. Okay, so the first one we take a look at here is the Courtyard by Marriott. Let's go in and check this out guys. We just walked in and the first thing is the smell. It smells so good in here. Well, thank you so much. Guys, it's amazing. It smells so good. Ah. Here at the court, I kind of think this one was more, maybe a little more like business. The breakfast is not included. They do have a breakfast area, but it's not included. You have to purchase your breakfast. It's, it's maybe a little up, more a little upscale. Here's the like, little lobby area. It's very nice in the evening. It's got a little fire and they got a little bar area for drinks. This is the bar and also Starbucks. Something really unique and fun. You see this little tiny door down here? You go up to the front desk and they have like the scavenger hunt and they're gonna tell you to go find these doors and all three hotels have these hidden doors, okay? And you click on these doors, not click on it, but you open it and look, there is a G because we're looking for like letters like for to spell Tigger. And so it's just fun for children. They get to go find these little hidden doors and uh, have some fun. Little scavenger hunt. Okay, 
the smell in here is amazing. I can't really describe it, I'll try my best. It's almost like a cinnamon bouquet that uh, it's warm and very inviting. It smells really good. I never even thought about the smells here, but man, it's like, it's really important to her. All right, so let me go here and show you the room here at Courtyard. Check this out. Look at this spacious living room. Oh, you have plenty of room to do activities. I love this, it's amazing. Now, if you can turn right over here, you're gonna be able to see, look at there's the giant, oh, look at that bed, perfect. Now the bed, if you notice, is aiming right here at the balcony. Let's see if I can figure out how to open there this There we up. go, I just open up, and look at this balcony. It is so spacious, oh. And you can look right over here in the pool, look at this, this is an indoor, outdoor pool. I'll kind of zoom in so you can see, you can swim right through that, right through there, this is, Really, really cool. Splash pad area right over there, hot tub. And let's go right back in this room and show, the, show it off here. Now I'm gonna show you, cause you probably wanna see the bathroom. Let's take a look at the bathroom. All right, so here you go. Here's your vanity. Look at the nice, beautiful sink. Well lit mirror, so that way you can prim and get all ready for the day. Ah, you always ask to see the closets. I got the closets right there. Very spacious. Uh, now there's that if you ever use that on your bathroom uh, in your, uh, on your vacation I don't know but right over here let's check out the shower now look at this the shower has got a bended bar which we like and also has got a little handrail which makes it super nice and you've got all your little amenities nice big shower head all right so I got one more one more little configuration to show you see this oh look at this credenza now look over here two beds very nice. This is like if you, uh, I mean, if you got like need more people to sleep, you'd want more beds. This makes complete sense. Nice little big mirror in the center right over here. Nice little uh, living area over here. And this room is super sweet. I like it. It kind of smells like orange zest, like you're soaring over California. It's like, I like want it. I want it all over my body. That smell, whatever it is. I don't know what it is, but I like it. Now I already showed this from the, the balcony. But this is the pool area. Very nice, you got the hot tub right over there. The pool goes right here. It goes into the indoor pool, see that? The pool is heated, it is heated. I remember I remember when I was very little, my parents, one time we stayed at a hotel that had like, a, uh, like an indoor outdoor pool like that, and I would just swim back and forth. I loved it, I still have that memory to this day as a child, it's so cool. And he's a, even as an adult, I like it. I still want to like swim through that. Uh -huh. This is the inside pool, it's a little bit warmer in here, and look at that. Going right through, swim right through, and they have a little hot tub over here as well. So cool. I want to just point some things out for parents with the young ones, little toddlers. This pool here, it's a sloping pool, so it's easy for kids. There's a little splash area for them to play. Doesn't get too deep too fast. And they have a little splash area that the kids can play in. Nice little area here, water going through this. It's kind of a little splash area for the children. Uh -huh. Now, I do want to talk about this because we were just looking here at the courtyard by Marriott. And across, we got the Fairfield Inn and we got the Spring Hill right over there. You can stay at any of these three hotels and be able to use the, that swimming pool, that area. They'll let you go in all the different areas. So like if you're staying in one hotel, you can hop around and use the amenities of any of these different hotels. It's all it's like this big huge, uh, I don't want to say compound, I'm going to say campus of Marriott hotels. It's like a Marriott resort. There's three different resorts here. She's the one you like the best. Right here between, look at this. This is right between, right over here and right over between. You got this nice little play area over there. You got a uh, jungle gym, you got the, what is that? Cornhole and a little area for the kids to kind of run around. Now I'm gonna take you into the Fairfield Inn and Suites here. We just walked in, the first thing you noticed, check it out, a little hopscotch. <laughs> okay, so first thing out of play, is you have to throw like a little like hoppy tie down. That's the one you have to skip over, ready? And then you gotta bend over and pick it up. Oh, my foot touched, I'm out. <laughs> All right, so now I'm gonna show you a room here at the Fairfield Inn, okay? So let's go in and check this out. They call this room the Double Double, what? Because there's two beds, that's why they call it Double Double. <laughs> I get it, I see what you did there, Fairfield. Now, if you look over here, this is wonderful. Something of note about the Fairfield Inn. This is something for safety, like when school groups are, none of the rooms have balconies. So if you're, if you're worried about a child in a balcony, then stay here at the Fairfield, no balconies, but they do have gorgeous views. You still look outside. Then over here, you got the double-double. Then over here, you got a nice little credenza. This desk pulls out. Look at that. That looks like an executive workspace. That's better than the offices I have when I used to work in the 
in the professional world. It's amazing, huh? Everything you need. Now let's go check out the bathroom. All right, here we are in the bathroom. Well lit vanity so you can see and get all nice and ready for the day. Here's your little closet space area to hang up everything you need. And of course, go right in here and take a look. Bended bar, we love the bended bar, that way it keeps the shower curtain away from you. We've got a full size tub, nice shower head, and all the amenities you could ever need. Ah, ah. All right, so next up, I'm gonna take you a look at the pool. It's like at the pool here at the Fairfield. All right, they have a little, nice little play area for the kids, we'll move out here. And we're gonna take a look right here at the pool. If you see this pool area, it is beautiful. They call this the chill pool. What? Come out here and just chill by the pool. Look at how nice this is. Absolutely gorgeous, beautiful pool. Nice little area. And then right over there, they have a hot tub. Somebody's in a hot tub. I don't want to invade their privacy, so I'm not going to go and film that, but they have it if you want it. All right, so now I'm going to show you what's called the family suite. So if you look here, we got a nice little bed, right? Ah, oh, that's a butt. Boom, pow, check this out. It's got bunk beds. Kids love this. Amanda and I love this. Usually when we come here, I usually get the top bunk. Amanda takes that one. Miles sleeps over here. But there's also like a little trundle. This comes out a little trundle. Now this option here just has a king bed with the, the bunk beds. But you can get an option where you get two queens and the bunk bed to sleep even more. I mean, look at these stairs. These stairs are actually drawers. Get out of here. Stair drawers, what will they think of next? Seriously, Fairfield, you guys are on top of it. Now, if you are staying here at the Fairfield, your breakfast is included, is complimentary. This is the dining area, it is large, and your breakfast is included with your stay. So if you're staying here at the Fairfield, your breakfast will be included. And I mean, look at this, it is, it is large, large area here. Very nice area for breakfast. Breakfast is served from 6.30 to 9.30. And I'm gonna, they actually have a little handy dandy sign to show you when it's least crowded and very busy for breakfast. I'll show you, it's amazing. This is called the plan ahead for excellent breakfast experience. 8.15 to 9.30 is the red zone. Everybody comes this time, heavy traffic. 7.45 to 8.15 is the yellow zone. Crowds begin to form. And then at the 6.30, 7.45, that's the green zone, best time. Which we wanna go there anyways, cause you wanna get the parks early, so sense this is the connections food hall there's amanda doing a little little soft shoe tap dance for you come on in now this is open from seven in the morning to 11 o'clock at night you can order food here and eat here or they'll even have it delivered up to your room no matter which hotel you're staying at here they'll deliver your room down here they have froyo for you they have nice little places where you sit and kind of relax and enjoy and they also have like some drinks and beverages literally the pizza sandwiches everything you want and it'll be it'll delivered to your room or you can eat it here. This is fantastic because there have been so many times where we get done with the parks, right? You get back to your room and you're like starving. You've worked up an appetite, but you don't want to go anywhere. You don't want to do anything. You're exhausted. This is here for you. Okay, I am now in the Spring Hill uh, Suites. Let's check this out. And first thing I want to show you is the breakfast area here. It is complimentary if you're staying here at this hotel. So let's check out the breakfast area. And did you hear this? They have Mickey waffles here, so you can create your own Mickey waffles, and it's the actual Disney recipe. What? So you start your day with a little bit of Disney magic. Yeah, and this is a very large area. It is it's it's all designing. It is complimentary. You're staying here. This is a nice little area. We're here in the afternoon, so it's kind of cleaned up for right now. But look at this. I mean, nice breakfast area. Again, if you're here at Spring Hill, this is included. The breakfast is included. All right, let's check this out here. This here, let's check it out. There you have a nice little living room area. It's a little bit different here. You have a nice, look at this. You got a sink over here. You got a fridge right there and a microwave, little credenza. And then you have a nice little bedroom, which is all separated by this nice little wall there. Moving over here, you've got your bathroom, full length mirror, ha ha. You got a nice well-lit vanity. And then this takes you into the bathroom. As you can see, bed and bar, we love that. All the menus you need right there. This is very, very sweet. Check it out. Yeah, this, I mean, this is sweet. And that bed does pull out if you need that bed to pull out. This whole building is all suites. Like every, every room you stay here at the Spring Hill, it's a suite like that. So it's very cool. Now, you guys, I just want you guys, we do these videos to, to kind of show you. These are like some off property uh, options for you. You can do some savings and get a really good rate on your hotel room when you come down here for a vacation. Now, the best way to do that is what do I want you to do? Is I want you to click on the link down below. So click that link down below. Where are you, Amanda? You're not- oh, I was, I was like, looking at the cute Mickey and Minnie. Oh, right, right, right. right. I got distracted. 
click the link down below, and if you click on that, you're gonna get the very best rates when you when you book these hotels, and also get the best rates on your tickets for Universal Studios, for uh, Disney, Disney World, everything you need to do. Or what or, I recommend is calling one eight five five Get Away. Tell yeah. them Provost Park Pass sent me, and you're going to unlock the best discounts and the best rates. And they're so friendly. We know yeah. them personally; they're friends of ours, and so they're gonna help you plan your dream vacation for Orlando. Don't try to do this yourself. Now you I want to talk about something that's unique about Get Away today. Yeah. If you get a ho if you book a hotel for them okay. here or in Florida, if you book a hotel with them and get park tickets, then they will give you their concierge ticket that service for free. It's, it's included. And it doesn't matter the value of the hotel that you're getting. Some people, some some places you have to have the highest level. No, it doesn't matter. Whichever level of hotel, as long as you're getting a hotel and tickets, your concierge service is free. That means you tell them what you want to do, they'll plan everything for you. It is a <laughs> changer and a game yeah. saver we would never ever ever try to do orlando without yeah. them they're the experts every time we come down we use our concierge yeah. service to absolutely do that so that's the best way to stay at one of these amazing hotels click the link down below hit the subscribe button yay you guys are like amazing it. hope to see oh, you oh i forgot to do this i forgot to do this uh -oh. okay if you if you want to stay at the courtyard type in oh, supreme yes. court okay. if you want to stay at the fairfield say uh right field if you want to stay at the springville springville field Spring, Spring Hill. Hill, type in Springville. Okay. Okay. And if, if you want to say it at the, the. All right, guys. If you want to say the S Hotel, type in S Slytherin. Because he's a Slytherin. Yes. <laughs> you guys are the very best. I'll talk to you later. Bye bye. Bye. Thank you. This was a hotel tour down in Florida. Bum, 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 bum. We want to help you save some money on your vacation. Dum, ba, dum, ba, 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 da, da, da. All of these hotels are great, and you're going to be happy no matter where you stay. Have fun on your vacation.